when I used to drink uh, regular cow's milk, uh, lots of issues would happen. When I was about eight, I couldn't drink a glass of milk without feeling sick. For a couple of years, um, I was feeling really uncomfortable after drinking milk. Normal milk used to leave me feeling a little bit not 100% feeling really upset in the stomach, you know, and, and quite unwell. We thought I was lactose intolerant. I went to soy. It's an acquired taste. It took a long time for me to get used to it. I heard so soy wasn't very nice, so I thought, oh, I better not go there, and I just pretty much put up with the pain for about three years, to be honest. We tried almond milk, soy milk, rice milk. It's just not the same. But I did that for, you know, pretty much my whole adult life because I was too scared to, to have real milk. I watched a documentary just by she coincidence um, about A2 milk and the different proteins in standard milk like A1, A2 protein and, and it kind of described symptoms that I had had. A friend recommended A2 and we tried it and we just didn't get it anymore. I gave it a go, had a little bit of uh, A2 milk on my uh, cereal one morning, no ill effects which was good. So I asked my mum to buy me A2 milk and haven't looked back, it's been great and then had it again the next day, it was fine. So I've, I've really had no issues with A2 milk, which has been great. A2 milk tastes great. I drink it in the morning with my cereal and with my protein shakes after gym. You know, milkshakes and tea and all that kind of stuff. No, I like I have a hot chocolate or in cereal or in the afternoons I'll just have a, a glass of milk. Chocolate milk? Yeah. Coffee? Banana smoothies? I prefer to just drink it on its own. Now that I drink A2, I don't feel sick anymore. Yeah, it's just a nice refreshing kind of thing to have and I know it's supporting um, the baby as well. It's the best thing I've ever done.